90% of everything is crap. This is known as Sturgeon's Law. Theodore Sturgeon was a science fiction author and back in the day, he was like an old school guy, back in the day people said that science fiction is bad. It's just a crappy genre and there wasn't much good in it. And his defense of this was, well, sure, there's plenty of bad science fiction, but other genres of literature and fiction have plenty of bad stuff in them too, so it's kind of pointless to single out science fiction. And you could say the same thing about anything. And I think there's parallels here with other genres as well of music, for example. Um, it's dangerous to say you like a certain genre of music. You might only know the best artists in that genre, but once you dig into it, there's plenty of crappy artists in that genre too. Um, so that's where this, that's the logic behind Sturgeon's Law, the notion that 90% of things are crap. But there's something positive based into that, which is if everything is crap, if 90% of anything is crap, you should feel better that what you produce is crap. Because I produce plenty of crap. We all do, right? Things that don't meet the very high standards we've set, that we just feel like we're not quite there yet and we need to keep producing. And there's something optimistic to know that even the greats, 90% of what they write doesn't work and it's not, not worth it, that producing crap will get you to producing good stuff, right? And this problem might even be more pronounced in the current era because of the ease of tools we have to make things, right? Before, if you wanted to make music, you had to raise enough money to get into a recording studio and make a record. Whereas the software and the tools and the things you need to make a record now are really, really cheap. So anybody can make a record, which might mean that we have more bad records, more bad music out there more bad software, more bad anything, that anytime we lower the barriers of entry, the barriers of production, then there's more crap that's out there. But I choose to see this optimistically. I choose to see this as keep making what you do. And the way you'll get better at producing and making is making whatever it is, whether it's startups, whether it's art, whether it's writing, whatever it is, just keep making. And over time, you'll get better.